He's planning for Wednesday, so it's on your mind. Schools are out again, many schools, because many roads are still covered from the weekend snowfall. But of course, that's not the only thing keeping schools closed. CBS 6's Jake Burns joins us live from Henrico with what else crews need to clear before students can get back to class. Hey, Jake. Well, Julie, we want to mention that Henrico Schools has not yet made an announcement about what they are going to do tomorrow. As soon as we hear from them, we'll let you know what they decide. But here at Highland Springs High School, just a few moments ago, a snowplow came through here and completely cleared out this bus loop for the very first time. So while school districts across our area are clearing out their school facilities, trying to do the best they can, their students are enjoying another day off today. Melting snow and ice means days of sledding <laughs> and wipeouts are coming to an end. It's been an interesting week. <laughs> We've got three small kids. The Jeffries family has done their best to entertain their little ones, but want the schools to reopen soon. Nuclear war is about all it would stop school when I went. VDOT and road crews have been at war with icy neighborhood roads across the region for about a day now. With progress still to be had on that front, schools have yet another concern. It's not just the roads that are a problem. School officials are working to clear out parking lots and sidewalks at schools. I'm told this parking lot right here at Montrose Elementary was completely buried yesterday, and today it's looking pretty good. This is only the second day that they've really had a chance to go in and get that work done, and with 70 sites throughout the county, it's an enormous task. We're making progress, but we've still got a lot of work to do. I just like some Andy Jenks calling me up with the phone call we've all been waiting for. The Jeffries admit they're ready for those closure calls to end. Their son John Henry though? Never. <laughs> That's not an option though. It should be. Now as cute as John Henry is right there, we didn't discuss whether or not his classmates and he are going to have to make up all this time they've missed so far this week and last. We'll have the answers from our local school districts coming up tonight at 6 o'clock.